And it's hollow inside. It's just, it's just a waste of space. Maybe it's just because he's more comfortable like having it like this. This is made by some independent dude. Uh, so I got it from him because. Sorry. Dang, we are starting already, folks. Welcome to another beautiful USC bi-weekly here held at the beautiful Bob Ross Room 227. We have got a hot match for you. We've got the legendary SoCal's best Ike player quick against our very own USC Mim. Yeah, this is a pretty interesting matchup considering the fact that um, I don't know how much uh, matchup experience Mim has against Ike, but it's a pretty simple game plan for him. Although Ike's do find the way, uh, very good ways to cheese people. <laughs> like he just attempts it to right there. Yeah, he's, he's doing it so far. True. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Friendlies. <laughs> hey, this is a very important friendlies match. I'm telling you, all of it is on the line right here. As Mim is being sent to the blast zone, trying to cover his bases, but quick not having it as much. This is the quality of a top 32 Ichigo Khan winner here. All right, already was stocked down and not too much on him, but this is where Byla shines. Yeah, quick managed. I think he managed to get that first stock because he held really good control over center stage. He was covering it really well with back air and just ledge trapping solidly. But even when Nim, even when Nim happened to slip by him, he still he just shifted to the center, focused his game plan, and got him back off stage to get the yeah. Ooh, Mim putting it all on the line with that down smash. I highly respect it, but uh, he's gonna pay with that. So now that like, he's got just barely sand control, he's gonna get by uh, Oh, reliable. You see that Mim trying to space those corners right there, but not gonna be able to do so against that yeah. wall of an up -y. At least uh, Ice kind of slow mobility is kind of preventing him from getting out of this corner right now. Mim yeah. doing a good job of reverse. Oh, uh, never mind. He was doing a great job of uh, reversing the whole stage controls uh, shindig earlier, but here we go. He's still, still he's not still, finding it. Still got to keep it up. Yeah, he tried to platform cancel that side B2. How does Project M? What is he doing? I'm surprised he's not throwing out a lot of jump tips right now. Maybe he doesn't want to be too obvious about it. Or maybe Ike is past the percent where he can get, like, hit yeah. down so hard. Because, like, it's, well, he's probably not going to get too much out of it, other than just, like, oh, hey, now's my chance for city control. He wants that kill right now. Ooh, good side view. I like that. Oh, such a good side view, but wow. nothing. Okay, finally, an arrow at 165%. Frank was a red hair. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Yeah. Both death. Oh god. That dash attack covered that, that, so good. Yeah. Good. The dash attack has been doing work this yeah. this first game. Right yeah. Now. Pretty much calling out all of his landings too. But here we go. Mim with the charge F smash. Not quite getting an angling down. And this might be just dangerous damage coming out from Mim. All right. Here we go. Coming back almost. And wow. already through the up B. That was so good. Just recognize that he just want to press that button. More. The iron curtain being put up right there. Hey. <laughs> Your ideals, Mousy Ding Dong. <laughs> hey, that was, that was a historical thing, like your, true. something your history teacher would say. Uh, true, yeah, my history com t uh, my history teacher, the commentator himself. <laughs> true. <laughs> true. <laughs> you see <laughs> All right, trying to find this landing on this huge stage, not finding it. It's so weird seeing like Phyllis struggle in like the part where they excel, where it's just like pushing people off stage. Yeah, off stage at the ledge. Get your chance, Mim. Get another stock. Oh, still, still was a good hit. It was a good hit. I just gotta read this. I think Mim is playing the arrow game fairly well. It's just that his landings keep getting called out, and at the same time, he's not being patient enough on the ground. Yeah, and then that's what happens. It was that dash attack just clearing the way for uh, Whip to try and steal out this game. Mim, honestly, like still holding it in very strongly here, not giving it up quite yet. Uh, waiting for it? Beautiful mix up. He's trying to put quick to the test to see if he's a closer. <sighs> quick is a closer though. Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah. Although his, he almost did it against Hungry Box, the clutch yeah. got himself. Oh, oh and the sneaky up tilt. Wow. I thought it was either Mim was either gonna up smash or it was gonna be an up tilt or something, but yeah, cool. yeah. Oh, our camera is dead and we will do that uh after this set, I was honestly expecting the uh, the four tilt to do this. To I think this is an unplugged situation. Can we get Moon and Gumpy? Okay, game two, sticking to the same stage. Um, 
I don't know if the game plan is going to change up a lot uh, from here uh, on Nim's side, uh, but let's see what adaptations he has in store. <laughs> Our very own Skittles complaining about the pay rate here <laughs> as we are being a Smash player at UFC as a student. Where's the union? Where's the union? <laughs> so, Lokesh trying to unionize the players, and I don't think Mousy Ding Dong is. Actually, you know what? Mousy Ding Dong would be a of fan of that. Yes, that's his whole thing. <laughs> Mass line, the mass movements, the proletarian masses fighting against our oppressive <laughs> the capitalistic overlords of fighting all. against the Steam players. No, no, Steam players are the real movement. Then they are mining those resources and holding True. it to themselves and not sharing it with the commons. Uh, I said uh, Quick was the best I can soak out. No, up there? Yeah, there we go. Guts is the best Roy player. True. <laughs> Sorry, Lokesh. I player, he's a Roy. No, no. He's not actually Guts from the Cirque. He's Guts from Fire Emblem. Oh, yeah, I that's right there. Yeah. <laughs> that's right on screen. He's here. Oh, that was a great down smash. It just being the shield, but Quick is not that kind of player. Yeah, Syro is crying right now. Yeah. Oh, I'm crying right now! Oh my god! <laughs> you mean, uh, Cookie Slayer? Cookie Slayer? Yeah, Cookie Slayer. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I remember the other tag. The other kind of Slayer. Oh, yeah, you said. 2DD <laughs> said Cookie Slayer. Yeah. And all the 2GGs too. And they said, hey, you can't, you can't. and they turned into Cookie Slayer. This era of Cookie Slayer and Small Dick Sand. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. Oh, I haven't oh, heard that tag in years. And Nick and Bernie. Okay, oh, yeah, that one, yeah. The, the platform pla pressure from Quick is doing numbers at this point. Like, it is, it is exponential how much damage Nim is being sold by now. Oh. He's a closer. He Ladies and gentlemen, closer. he's a closer. Ladies, if you want a closer, you got Owl Quick right here, folks. That's still a moment at the mouth of that F Smash. They're so mean. I don't know. <laughs> Base game Pyra going Pam. Base game Pyra. <laughs>